You're under pressure, basically. Oh, yeah, we're on the ropes. Three months ago, I was kind of quietly confident that we'd have a nice race. Um, and by now, you know, one team, and I was kind of hoping it would be our team, would have a bit of a cushion. Um, but that's not to be. Yeah. You know, our Southern Ocean problems with the track led to uh, a big points deficit and you know that's evened up the score so from the outside it might make it more entertaining but from where I sit it makes it a lot more worrying. How do you view this one? It looks incredibly close but it looks rather different to the other events. You know this is the second run in these boats they are very one design I think for those who don't realize they're more one design than a laser you look at the percentage difference in the weights the hulls for example it's it's less than a laser um, you know in a laser you can take your own tiller extension we can't change anything can't even cut the end of a bit of rope off so they are very very similar and i guess in the end that makes the boats very tweaky and i think there's a necessity to push them harder to push the guys harder to get the best out of them so this race is it's it's like a uh, a long long inshore I guess the question that everybody outside would want to ask would be how do you make sure that you finish on top of the podium in, after two legs? I think it would be much easier if there was just two boats but now there's three um, which I, for the outside world I think makes it much more fascinating but for us as a team I think it makes it a little more complicated but um, no, it's going to be a long tough two weeks for our team and I think for all these teams um, I think we're just going to take it on. The way the points are at the moment, they're that close. It could all, potentially, it could all come down to a big showdown right at the end. Explain that to us. Yes, if we end the race for the offshore portion being even on points, then the tie break will go down to whoever's leading the inshore series. We did predict this being a possibility, and it is a real possibility right now. You know, the points difference between the top three boats, I think, is only two, two or three points. Um, that could easily come down to it being, the tie being broken by the inshore series. So the whole thing could come down to the import race. How stressful would that be? <laughs> very stressful, but I have to say, I mean, I, I think our, our guys are very strong in import race, so I wouldn't be that worried if it was. <laughs>